After years away, a local artist returned back home to Binghamton, giving up his career in Nashville to paint people's pets. Brianna Kay shares with us this unique story tonight. I don't know how he does it. He's magical. Magical. One of the words used to describe the work of Binghamton native Chris Weeks. 29-year-old says he always knew he wanted to create art. In 2010, shortly after graduating college, he became an art teacher in Nashville, Tennessee. And I blended a lot of uh, arts with social-emotional learning, uh, where the kids uh, developed um, how to really learn empathy and um, and express themselves through uh, in creative ways. Week says he believed in the power of painting. So after five years of teaching, he quit and came home. People love their pets. With a different type of subject, Weeks began painting pets, and he's created 20 pieces of art since. I can uh, reach people uh, very similarly to how I did in teaching, but through creative. Uh, paintings. I found that painting people's pets uh, is a really unique and very personal way to reach that person. Chris says that his paintings create an emotional connection for his customers. More than half of the time uh, that I give them one of these or they deliver it, they, uh, they have some kind of tear of joy, which is, that's why I do it. When I got it, I cried. So... And my mom cried when she got hers as well. I mean, the dog had died, so it was uh, emotional and it was a surprise. She didn't know she was getting it. Metcalf had Weeks paint a picture of her two cats and her mother's dog. The final product left an incredible impact. I said to Chris, I was like, it's amazing. I was crying and he was like, it's fine, everyone cries. Appreciation for a product created by one man's passion to paint. That's the only solution to uh, success is just to keep trying. In Binghamton, Brianna Case, WBNG-TV Action News. Week says he hopes to continue his painting and work with local schools to teach them the importance of art and plants. Check out our website, WBNG.com, to learn more about him and his passion.